Hello everybody, this is Kevin once again with Simple4XTester.com. As part of the multi-time frame update, I actually went a little bit further. Um, I know a lot of people like to use this thing called a period converter with MetaTrader 4. And what this allows you to do is create your own custom time frames. Now this script comes with MetaTrader 4 normally, but what I did is incorporated that into Simple4XTester to make it even that much more powerful. What the period converter allows you to do is simply apply it to a chart and tell it what multiple you would like to use. For example, if you wanted to create a two hour chart, which is not a standard chart, but nevertheless you could create it and trade off of it, you would apply the period converter to a, to a one hour chart and give it a multiple of two, basically saying times everything by two. So once again if you were to apply the period converted to a one hour chart and say three then it would create a three hour chart for you I incorporated that directly into simple forex tester so let's take a look at how that works so inside of the tester settings I'll come over here to expert properties and uh, making sure that simple for access to version 2 is selected and in the, in the expert properties we have a couple of different variables that we can change um, the first three are, are simply labels you don't need to change those at all use multi time frame if you set this to true then you can actually use multiple time frames and the video prior to this one shows you how to do that custom time frame settings is what we're interested in now so if you uh, by default this is set to false but if you set this to true it'll create a custom time frame for you and what you do here is you give it the multiple in which you wish to convert it so um, as an example I'm gonna go ahead and leave it at four and these are whole numbers now yeah you can do uh, one two three four uh, all the way up as high as you want to go uh, you cannot do 1.5 or 1.7 or anything like that so just keep that in mind whenever you're whenever you're creating this so now I'm gonna leave this at 4 and I'm going to uh, be running a test on a 5 minute chart and what this is going to do is create a 20 minute chart for me uh, and now I know that not something that you would <laughs> probably want to do you know trade off a 20 minute chart you can if you want to but this is just an example so uh, I'm going to leave this at true and I'm going to leave this at four so remember if I'm testing on a five minute chart it's going to times that multiply that rather by this number here so uh, five minutes times four is 20 minutes so it'll create a 20 minute chart for me where every bar is 20 minutes worth of time so once again just simply make sure this is set to true if you'd like to use this feature and then set this to the period you would like to convert and simply click OK and then at this point make sure you selected your proper time frame once again I'm going to select a five minute chart that way uh, I can create a 20 minute chart and at this point sim simply click start now it's going to do uh, what simple forex tester normally does build all the data it'll say program startup OK click the OK button you see on the left here it's going to be building your time frames uh, building 15 and then it's going to go to 30 and then hourly and so on all the way up to monthly this is because I chose to do multi time frame as well so let's give it a couple of minutes daily weekly and then it's going to go to monthly and as soon as this is done it's going to automatically start running the test okay so now the test is running you can speed it up and slow it down as you see fit but now let's go ahead and uh, open an offline chart now just the same way you do with multi time frame you're gonna go to file open offline and we're testing the pound US dollar so it'll be pound US dollar underscore TST remember so we're gonna go down pound US dollar underscore TST and look what we have here a 20 minute chart so pound US dollar underscore TST and it'll say minute 20 so simply double click it and there you go here's a 20 minute chart that we can trade off of now you can further confirm this fact by clicking on the data window uh, if you don't see the data window already it's the little crosshair you can click it it'll show you your data window and if you'll notice the times go up by 20 minutes each 540 and the time being here 440 uh, 5 520 40 and then uh, 6 o'clock and then 6 20 and 40 and 7 o'clock and so on so each one of these candles is now 20 minutes and you successfully created a multi time frame or a uh, not only a multi time frame uh, test but you're also doing 
a, uh, a completely custom period which again you can normally do in uh, MetaTrader 4 with the use of that period converter script but now you can actually do it inside a simple forex tester as well so now I've got this five minute chart that I can trade off of I've got a 20 minute custom chart that I can also uh, do technical analysis and trade off of and since I have multi time frames set up I can also go to file open offline scroll down to the pound US dollar and pick any one of these charts of the standard multi time frame charts from minute one all the way up to weekly so I'll pick an hourly chart and it opens up the hourly chart and we can trade off of this one now as well so just tile vertically so we can kinda see here and here it is 20 minute chart and the hour chart and that's really all there is to it